So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to set up AirTags and connect AirTag to the iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch. And if you're not familiar with these little AirTags, these are them right here, and they're basically used to help keep track of things you may misplace, and if you do lose them, to find them easily. Now, before we get started, you do need to make sure you have an eligible device. That means an iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch that's running the software version of iOS 14.5 or later. And if you're using an iPad, iPad OS 14.5 or later as well. There's actually another update about to go on right now. Once you have that set up, ensure that you have Bluetooth enabled. So pull down your control center, make sure Bluetooth is on. And then we can move to the AirTag setup. Now, setting it up is pretty simple. All you're going to do is remove this plastic. So out of the box, the battery is not activated yet. When you remove the plastic by pulling it out, you hear that sort of chime that activates the battery. And now these are activated and set up. At this point, you're just going to take these air tags and bring them close by to your iPhone. So just unlock the phone. You'll see this little connect icon appear on your screen and then you're gonna tap and follow these on-screen instructions. This is how you connect the AirTags. So we'll tap connect, choose where it's going to be connected to or what you're gonna have the AirTag in, whether it's a jacket, a bag, a keychain. For the most part, uh, for me, it's on my keys. We'll tap keys and tap continue. Now at this point, you're going to see your Apple ID with the phone number associated with it. We'll tap continue. And it's just going to take a few seconds to set up the AirTag. All right, so it took about 15 to 20 seconds to set up. When you hear the chime and see this page, you're ready to go. You can read through this and uh, see what it all does. But at this point, we can tap done. And now the AirTag is set up and connected to our iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch. And if at any time you lose these AirTags, you can just open up your Find My application, this one right here and tap on the items icon at the bottom and you'll be able to see all the air tags you have connected here. And if you ever lose them, you can tap on them and then try to find them. But that is how to set up air tags and connect the air tag to your iPhone, iPad or iPod touch. If you're looking for a full complete tutorial on how to use these air tags, there's a link in the description. I put together a full a rundown of everything you can do with these air tags including the setup but also how to find them if you lose them or if someone takes it or if whatever it was connected to is lost it's very important to understand everything about how they work because they are pretty powerful and there's also some safety features you may want to look into as well before you start using them anyway that is it for this video. If you enjoyed it, hit the like button, subscribe and click the bell notification box. It's free. The bell just lets you know when I post the next video. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next video.